Hey everybody, uh, this is not a close up obviously, it's a far up. I, <laughs> I just thought that uh, I, I need to start showing you guys a little bit more about how great tail is so that we can finally get her adopted. So, Hollywood, I guess they say, show don't tell. So I wanted to include her and the chat with you guys in the micro. And uh, if I just start recording this as I have, this will get included in tomorrow's micro upload, um, even though it's from one of the regular cameras. So we're going to start there. And then at the end, maybe we'll do an actual little tiny micro close up uh, that's up close. But I wanted to show you how playful she can be in addition to how noisy she can be and what a sweetheart she is, obviously. So I brought a toy for her to play with. Let's see if she will. I would really like to do some real close-ups with all of you soon. Uh, I miss having the ability to chat with you on YouTube. Um, and uh, I finally have got the network doing all the things that I wanted to, kind of, you know. It's never going to be 100%, is it? But uh, everything's working, so that's nice. All right, so you ready to play? What is it? Huh? You want it? Oh. Do I need to move that camera a little bit? Check the angle. Oh, oh, that's a fun one. Yeah, that's more fun than what we were playing with last night. Okay. Here, where's it at? Go. Oh. Good catch. Oh, that's actually probably a pretty good angle right there. That's good. It's going to get. Okay, it's still come on. She likes to go in the tunnel too, but it's hard for me to get this in a position where she has to go in there to get it. I was getting her last night to like run through the tunnel. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, nice one. Nice jump. Oh, can you guys see if I put it in the unicorn? I gotta check that. Oh yeah, you can. Kind of. Get it, come on, give us a jump. Oh, okay. Yeah. I know I make fun of her for being such a big cat, but she's all muscle. Like, she's a strong kitty. There we go. Oh, oh, get it. You can't take it that way, though. You can't. No, you got to go up and through. Or just let it go. Oh, okay, that was a mistake. There we go. <laughs> still looking for an adopter, and uh, I know that she's going to be a great cat for somebody, because I'm showing you how playful she is right now. I know I've told you about it, and you don't get to see this as often as I would like, um, but she's also a great lap cat. She loves to just sit on my lap all day if she can. Um, when, uh, when we're in the bedroom watching TV, she comes and sits on my lap and just wants to be pet, and she's the best for smelling what DJ will tell you that, too. She's just wonderful. She's basically a kitten herself, I think. Um, here, let's take a look at you. Come here. Come here. It's been a while since I've looked at your teeth. I don't remember how young you look based on your teeth. Let me just see real quick. I know. I know. Oh, those are brand new. So, yeah, she's pretty young. She's um, she probably had her kittens at, at almost the earliest opportunity. I'd say she's probably not older than two, not much older, if that. But still really a kitten. As you can see, she can get along with other cats as long as they're not aggressive. Um, if they are, then uh, you know she is a little bit too submissive, and it takes her a little bit of time to warm up to other cats too. But uh, it can be done. I think she'd be fine with a calm, especially like a calm older cat would be perfect for her. Somebody more like uh, Loganberry or Eddie could, you know, would be a good companion, not somebody like Maggie 
or custard. I say Loganberry. Loganberry does not get along with her, though, for some reason. So, so that's a surprise to me. I would expect them to get along. But she's fine with, say, Eddie or Ari. You slowing down? You're not slowing down. You're just trying to conserve your energy. Oh. She's good at playing too. Like a lot of cats will just hang on to it until the end of time and just end the game because they won't let go. But uh, like Ari, Ari's really good too, where he, he doesn't want to catch it and hang on to it. He wants it to go again right away. And she's doing the same thing. I think she's slowing down a little, and I think if I do a, a micro close-up, that recording will end itself, and that'll all just work out. So let's try that. I see somebody on Discord uh, is them asking, like, how do you, what do you tell when you look for on teeth? It's, it's honestly, it's not a science. I was just looking at how clean they are, which is usually kind of a sign, um, but it's not necessarily a sign. You can't, you can't really tell anything except whether they have adult teeth or not, and that happens from like six months to a year. So all you can say with certainty is that she's older than six months, which I think we know. But when the teeth look new and they're playful like this, um, and most of the mom cats we get are pretty young, um, that's why I say I don't think she's any older than two. But again, you don't you don't really know. I know. Hang on, let's do this. There we go. Do you want to play just a little bit more from this angle? Yeah. Till? Yeah, you good? Show everybody how pretty you are. Oh yeah. I should have started with this angle. She looks so good. Can you put it away? You want to get petted? Yeah, you always want to get petted, though. What are you saying? She's 
You remember she came to us with this collar because her previous foster loved her so much they sent her with a collar and a note explaining how great she was. And uh, they were right. And we've never had that happen with a cat that's come to us ever, so you know she's something special. I know she'll find the right adopter soon. Very soon, right? Yeah, and then we can free up some rooms for new mom cats. Rooms and time. Anything else you want to say to the people? I'm sorry, what? Yeah, I agree. You want a shrimp? No? Okay. <laughs> what is it? Are you too riled up to come sit on my lap for a minute? Bet you are. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll do that later. Uh, you know, I should have put the microphone on the camera because she's purring right now. You probably can't hear that from all the way over there where you guys are. Sure you can tell though. All right, well, that was our morning check-in with Pill. Maybe we should keep doing this as long as she's not adopted, and hopefully I can do it as a real close-up soon. I still gotta work on that part a little. Say goodbye to the people. Actually, you can keep watching her, that's fine too.
that wasn't as fun as I thought it would be. When I came down here a minute ago, they were all up here. They all looked at me. And it was uh, cute. I didn't have my phone, so. <laughs> 